Hi guys, welcome to my channel. How to factory reset HP laptop? So guys, open and right uh, click to start button, then click to setting, then system, slow down, click to recovery, reset. This is factory reset. Okay. So guys there are two options keep my file remove everything if you take fully clean fully fresh so clean click to this one and uh, sorry this one hi guys welcome to it networking how to factory reset of hp laptop so first click to windows key then click to setting Then click to system, slow down, click to recovery, then reset this PC to click. So keep my file. If you click to this one, so keep your file and other settings is automatically reset. And if select this one, remove everything. So fully fresh, remove all data and settings and all everything software with also. So I need to clean everything. So click this one and please wait few minutes okay this is cloud download and this is local download cloud means you have a too good internet so you can click this one if you have a don't do not have a local uh, internet and uh, good internet so click this one this is all automatically reset and uh, automatically to remove and fresh installation to take so i have a internet tool so click to download and then click to next now this is getting ready so guys uh, additional disk space needed i don't have a space that is uh, not to process so now this is cancel cancel so again click to reset pc now and try to click to remove everything and try to local install okay then next Then guys click to remove the program file user account on this PC, remove changes mode and app and windows, reinstall windows from the systems, okay. Then click to restart. Now this is process start.
then guys click to yes select your languages and keyboard your country one more keyboard had to add keyboard otherwise click to skip then agreement to accept then device name networking then next skip so there are two options personal and work for office like this select any next then guys this is policy settings to require define my device and location if you need to know so access or deny then click to next accept all so guys finally this is start okay and fresh and up to date okay then guys click again click to start button then go to setting then click to windows update and check for an update and then install okay okay thank you guys